Hey guys, besides my Arch Linux machine, I have two, three laptops, and you might be wondering why. It's because the laptops I get from work are device managed. They're supervised and managed by either my employer or the client that I'm working on or with. And I'm not allowed to use that laptop for, for client work and, and, and vice versa. There needs to be a strict separation. So often I don't want to carry a couple of, a couple of laptops around, but I need to, you know, do my time entry for my for my work. And you'll be wondering how how do I do that without going crazy? The way I do it is set up screen sharing. And let me just demonstrate how I do that. I set up Tailscale on my machines. So I'm logged in here. So this is my uh, my my laptop that I keep at home and now I need to set up screen sharing and that's just as simple as doing uh, this I have screen sharing on remote login is SSHD by the way uh, I think I just leave it at the defaults what have you you do need this password to be set if you want to use Arch Linux to connect to it but I find it just a terrible experience and once you have this enabled, you can connect to the machine remotely. I can demonstrate that to you using my other laptop. So here's another Mac laptop, please forgive me. And what I do again is make sure I'm logged into Tailscale. I grab my uh, the IP and then I go into Finder and I connect to it. Prompts me for my password. And boom, I'm connected. Well, this is great, very useful. And the client actually um, is, is pretty nice. I can use both displays essentially. And the internet is great in Singapore. But there is a problem. When I connect to this machine, the machine and my home office becomes unlocked and my my kid can basically jump on the machine and start using it and this is really annoying and I expressed my frustration about this um, property of screen sharing on on reddit let me just find you the right thing well as you can see I got like something like a hundred upvotes on reddit and I didn't really some people say I need um, remote management, but I tried that and it still has the same problem. And then another thing says I need to buy Apple remote desktop. I don't really want to buy Apple remote desktop if I don't know if it's going to work. Anyway, I, I'm living, I, I, funny enough, I noticed that there were some Macs at, 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 a, at a client where they were, had the same problem, that they were allowing their, um, their that they had their employees basically dialing back into the, the Macs at work and essentially their machine was just being used there and you can just jump on the keyboard and type things. So I'm curious, um, do you guys use screen sharing? Are you aware that your machine sort of locally unlocks when you're screen sharing it? Isn't it a bit daft? Um, what's your solution? Uh, to be honest, I'm more keen to use a native Apple solution. I don't want to install some some so extra software. So there you have it. That's, that's how I screen share and save myself carrying laptops around. Please like the video and comment below. Bye guys.